whether it's working on agility, working on endurance, or working on strength. It's that accomplished feeling. Anna Konapski's journey has been more painful than most. While every athlete finds their breaking point, some find it within themselves to rise above whatever obstacles there may be. She's looking for the height, um, the best you can be. Get a drink. Anna's drive has taken her to heights few will ever know. Um, I already have two world records. And I plan to continue to just keep re-breaking them. While her relentless workouts give her strength. Napsky's real strength comes from her faith. Anna, we're going to bake these at 350. And from her family. And you know what? It doesn't matter if your mom says, I love you, you're beautiful, you're happy, you're pretty. That doesn't matter. It's what the rest of the world says that matters. In fact, Anna's greatest foes have not been those who challenge her in a gym but the classmates who have tried to beat her down with their words. She tried to ignore it. She cried a lot. I cried with her. It was hurtful. Like, I felt like I was this nice person. You know, why are, why are they being mean to me? Middle school bullies were targeting Napsky because of her weight. Here at University Hospital. Well, bullying can have pretty severe consequences on children. Clinical psychologist Dr. Carol Landis. This is happening in every middle school, in every grade school, in every high school, you know, throughout the country, if not the world. It hurts. It hurts way down deep. And, and you know, it's not just her I hurt for. It's all the children in this world that are suffering under someone bullying them. I was in kind of a dark place when I was overweight, and it was like, my gym was kind of like my light to my new world. Anna's new world included new friends who inspired her to achieve what no one else ever had. <laughs> From her darkest days has come a champion for whom the sky is the limit. Yes! Ever since I started throwing, I want to go to the Olympics. How I look at her and I and marveled at how well she does. Come on, baby, let's go outside. You have the strength deep down inside of you to walk away from that person being mean to you. Yeah, you give me a kiss. People don't realize that what they say and do. So not you so big and he She will always wear the scars from that. Hold on. In Canton. Good boy. Dave Nethers, Fox 8 News. No, I didn't. Hey, I did not say go yet. No, I didn't. No, I didn't.